week, Ohio State came out with self-imposed sanctions. They forfeited all of 2010, and they'll be under probation for the next two years, but the NCAA can still come down harder. That uncertainty means adversity that Ohio State is having to overcome. There you go, change your expectations. Before he spoke to local high school all-stars about being better people, Ohio State safeties coach Paul Haynes spoke to the media about rising up in tough times. The thing that happens in adversity is you pull tighter together and you work even harder. So I think that's the thing that you're seeing with our kids is they're doing, you know, the extra. But for recruits who may be looking at the Buckeyes, the instability of the coaching staff past this season may be a factor, right? Ohio State is bigger than the coaching staff. Ohio State is bigger than just you know, one player and things like that. The kids that want to be a part of it and want to be a part of Ohio State will. The kids who don't, you know, won't. We want kids who want to be there. Um, you know, we don't want to have kids to try to force them to be there. We want the kids who want to be a Buckeye. While Haynes' statements may all be true, the threat of more penalties against the program has led the school up north to make more recruiting noise. Michigan's 2012 class is ranked as high as second in the country, but Haynes is anything but flustered. Hey, we're we're kind of like foot soldiers. We fall in line and we just keep going. I mean, on September 3rd, the ball's going to be kicked off, you know, and that's kind of our goal. Because that's the only thing Ohio State controls right now. It's fate on the field. And after Haynes got done speaking, the top high school players from this past year strapped on the pads for practice. We'll be previewing Friday night's All-Star game all week long. It's the last chance to see these guys before they move on to the next phase of their lives, college.